Roblox games with creepy secrets. I've explored many innocent looking games where at first glance it looks completely harmless, but upon exploring more, you realize it's something incredibly dark and disturbing. From games about experimenting on players to a weird church with creepy secrets, I'm going to take a look at different Roblox games and then find out what their dark secret is. Now let's start off with this video here. Yeah, so here's the game here, testing if fashion diva thing is real. So yeah, a lot of people say that there's a lot of fake players on this game, which I'll show in a little bit. I played this game before, uh, so he's exploring the play. It looks totally normal, <laughs> except for that uh, that face right there, which is it looks pretty creepy, honestly. So he's walking around, showing off the different things. It looks like it's a real game, but the players themselves aren't actually real. So it says here, time to say it. So if you say something along the lines of, these are all bots, the game teleports you to something dark and mysterious. So yeah, it's just complete darkness. That's the same exact game, it's just completely dark. Loud warning, uh oh. Oh yeah, there's like a jump scare here. Is it, when's it gonna play? Oh, <laughs> The, yeah, that's the same face again from the beginning of the video. It froze my game. Um, but yeah, here it is, Fashion Diva. It's a spinoff of the game Fashion Famous. It's got a whole runway. It looks totally innocent. But then you read the description and realize all the words are lowercase except a couple of them. And if you collect these letters that are actually uppercase, you begin to spell out a whole sentence. So here's my notepad here. So let's go ahead and type in I S T H this working. So someone's trying to communicate with us here. We got another C A N. So the word can you hear me? Yeah, that's uh, that's pretty spooky. But let's go ahead and jump into the game and see how much darker it can actually get. All right. So we're in here. It seems totally innocent. It says the theme is spring. Uh, what's this? I need more accessories to make my character fabulous. See, now the thing is this person, if we find this name here, uh, they don't actually exist on the player list here, which means that uh, they're actually not real. Same with a lot of these other players here too. Yeah. Prepping rich is not actually real 12 queen of hearts isn't actually real i'm in a game full of bots i did notice last time when i played this game that the face that was on the tiktok video isn't there anymore not sure what that's about all right it's time for the moment of truth are you all bots uh oh oh no i got teleported oh no this happened way too fast oh no i'm scared <laughs> it says here cleans runway okay so it's still the same game um can we still explore here i want to see oh there are the faces here <laughs> oh no i got goosebumps <laughs> oh there there's a whole bunch of them uh oh i don't like this hello is, it, is anybody here oh, oh, geez. Stop, stop. Oh. <laughs> that's so loud is it still gonna keep going? Yeah, I can't press escape at all. I can't press F11 either. Yeah, we're uh, we're stuck here. Let's do the old control alt delete here. So it's just uh, NTAS Roblox before that blows up my PC. Yeah, and if you go to the game's group chat here, there's a lot of people freaking out about this game. Is it real? I'm gonna try a fake account because they're saying it'll ban you. I was wondering if you could patch the glitch of the bots teleporting you to a random game. Please, please, please. It is scary. It's dangerous. I hope y'all are safe and sound. Make sure to stay safe. Want to be safe and never play the game. It's so scary. If you do it again, I'm going to report you. God bless y'all. <laughs> um, something I also noticed, and the creator of Fashion Diva, there's also more words that are capitalized here. Let's see if there's any more dark secrets about it. So we got the T H E the R E. There are there are B O T S. There are bots. Help us! Oh no, they need help. Yeah, and this isn't the first time that these developers made a creepy game such as Fashion Diva. They uh they made another innocent looking game called uh, Daycare here. And the description says four. Okay. Oh, uh, let me just show you what it's about yeah so here we are here's the daycare it's daytime uh it looks totally normal and everything except for this sign here that says click to become a scientist now why do you need a scientist at a daycare area well if you click on the tab setting you can see here there's two options patient or scientist now i thought this was just a daycare why is there uh why is there actual like patients and all that <laughs> well let's go ahead and become a scientist over here ow i didn't realize it'll kill us um we then get teleported over to this room oh yeah take a look at that the music just suddenly stopped <laughs> and then yeah here's the lab room where you do all the experiments with some of your patients uh as scientists here let's go ahead and take a look at some of the patients that we have here let's go to the patient room oh hello <laughs> here's our friend marco here <laughs> oh yeah he is smaller than me hello there are you enjoying the daycare here i see we also have a snatch option what happens if we like click this <laughs> what the heck? What is this? Help! <laughs> Let's just, uh... Hold on there, Sonny. We're gonna take you over here to this, uh... To the experimentation room. So let me just take you over here. Leave you in here. So, uh, yeah, this is my new patient now. <laughs> um, what kind of things can we do here? I'm scared. You should be. <laughs> so let's see, what happens if we press begin here? Oh. 
Uh, so yeah, this whole daycare thing is actually just a lie. Oh, they're out. Uh, they're turning colors. Are they gonna blow up? Uh oh. <laughs> uh, let's get a new patient, shall we? Oh, it's nighttime. Dude, what the heck? Wait, this turned dark as well. <laughs> Wait, this looks kind of creepy now. Here, I'm not done with you. We're going to do more experiments. <laughs> Into the chamber, please. All right, let's see. What's the highest level we can make this toxin? Five? <laughs> oh, what's going to happen now? <laughs> Be calm, Marco. Wait, this guy is also a part of this as well. I feel kind of evil, actually. <laughs> oh, he's a ghost now? What's happening? <laughs> Are you okay? Uh... Let's, let's, oh, did, did we kill him? Boy, this game is actually kind of fun. I want to snatch more victims now. Oh, look, we've got another person joining. <laughs> Hi. Uh, come on. Come here with me, buddy. Oh, <laughs> uh, I turned my joints on so a lot of random people could just join in with me. Hello there. This will only hurt a little. <laughs> let's begin, shall we? You played my game, torture other people. Oh, this is one of the developers. Sorry, I'm doing this again to you. <laughs> oh, you just started on fire. What the heck? Uh oh. Wait, I'm sorry. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. Oh, jeez. Uh, no, yeah, honestly, this game is pretty funny. You could just, like, snatch people from the daycare here. Oh, uh, you could just drag them over to the experimentation room. Oh, <laughs> uh, another game that also has a weird dark secret, and to this day, I still don't know why it was made, is uh, this one here, Empty Sermon. I played this game a couple of times just because I'm so curious about it. It was last updated nine years ago, and to this day, still remains a mystery. So, yeah, you start off in, like, this church here. That seems completely normal and seems like you can't really, like, do anything in here. That is, until you step on the podium, and do absolutely nothing. So yeah, you'll soon begin to realize that the camera pulls out for whatever reason. And uh, if you move around, nothing happens again. But uh, let's see what happens if you just stay still the entire time. All right, so it's been like 10, 15 seconds now and nothing has happened yet, but you still just gotta be patient with the game for the dark secret to occur here. Oh yeah, and then there's like a white flash here. Uh, let's see what's happening. It's completely bright. Uh oh. Oh yeah, and then there's like a lot of figures down here. I forgot about this. Jeez, what's happening? Oh, oh, there's somebody behind me. Oh, jeez. Right, we can't show this part right here. We can show the person behind me is trying to kill me. Um, is it gone? I, th I think that's it. Is, is there more here? Like, why was this game made? Like, what was the point of it? Yeah, it kind of reminds me of that one church that was made by actual cultists. I believe the game's been removed, but if you go inside the church, it looks completely normal. Everything's totally fine. A lot of people are actually going into this game to actually like pray and stuff. But it's when you jump out of the window is when you realize the true nature of this game. All right, so here we go. Green Lego cat about to jump out and they get teleported to this other part of the map oh yeah look at the chat here it says you're now on the sinner team you could also hear like some sobbing in the distance as well and then eventually you find this portal here if you enter this portal you get teleported to a, a demonic church like area <laughs> yeah the whole thing's pretty uh freaky here um we're gonna have to blur that part out um there's a whole pentagram in the middle and everything but this is where the creator of the game and some of the higher ups go to uh to do a uh, satanic stuff in here <laughs> and again this is supposed to be a secret until Green Lego Cat and a few other people expose these people. I don't think the game exists anymore, but it's still pretty disturbing how innocent it seems, but then in reality, it holds a dark secret. But yeah, let me know if there's other games with dark secrets that you want me to play. Don't forget to subscribe. Goodbye.